Hi everyone, I'm Zach from Porsche Center Calgary and today I'm here with our 2021 718 Boxster Spider with PDK. Uh, this vehicle comes with a chalk exterior with a two-toned uh, Bordeaux red and black Spider classic interior in it. Um, the main part of this car and what makes it special is, for one, this is essentially the GT variant of the Boxer, so very much like your GT4, where you have your same 4-liter, naturally aspirated flax motor. Um, it puts out 414 horsepower in this vehicle, and you're able to rev it out to 8,000 RPMs, giving, yes, yeah, for one, it gives you a tremendous sound, um, and it gives you a very, very engaging feel. It can be a whole lot of fun. Um, and then that combined with your PDK transmission, so that's going to be your uh, seven-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission. Um, yeah, it makes for, I guess, for one, the PDK, it's very intuitive. Um, this actually pretty much feels like while you're driving the car, the longer you're driving it, the better it learns where your shift points are, your driving habits. So combined with that, um, like I said, it just makes for a tremendously kind of emotional, visual drive with this vehicle. Um, it being the Boxster 2 in our mid-engine sports car, of course, it's going to be incredibly nimble. Um, so really, it's a vehicle, if you're just wanting to go out there on a nice, twisty, windy mountain road, you don't necessarily have a destination. Um, cruise around with your roof top down. It's absolutely fantastic for that. And then at the same time, if you're wanting to have some fun in those corners, um, it is going to give you that very visceral driving aspect. So it's a, it, it is just a very exciting car to own and, and to be able to drive. Um, talking about a few of those other performance options that kind of contribute to how this vehicle feels. Um, for one, as the Spider, you're going to have your PASM in the car standard, so that's the ability to stiffen up your suspension, reduce body roll, give you that slightly stiffer feel. And then, of course, the Sport Exhaust, which uh, we already talked about the sound that that naturally aspirated motor gives you already. Um, but it does have Sport Exhaust to enhance that even more, so you do have the ability to turn that on and off, open and close a valve there in your exhaust system. That way, if you are wanting a slightly quieter ride, pulling out of the house, or you just had enough of the sound, you can't have that option. But at the same time, if you do really love that extra sound that the Sport Exhaust gives you, um, personally, I'm a huge fan of it. I always really like it in these vehicles. Um, then you can open up those valves and have that uh, extra sporty, engaging sound coming out of it. A um, few other things to touch on regarding performance. Um, other things are going to be your 20 inch wheels. As you can see here, very unique. These ones are going to be painted in your satin orum, so that cold color. Uh, we don't see that in too many cars, and I think it goes really nicely with this truck, actually. Um, and then, uh, in general, the exterior of this Boxer Spider, um, it is very much like what you'd have with your sport design body package in something like the GTS, of course, with its own individual elements. Um, you'll notice, especially when we're talking about the roof, um, it is an automatic roof. It is a manual roof, so you do, do have to go and put it down by yourself. Um, it's actually a relatively quick and easy process. You can do it with one person. You don't need to have two people working on it. Um, so that is pretty fast, but you do have to hop out of it. But once again, everything with this car is kind of going towards that more emotional, purest feel. Um, another example is if you look on the inside, the tabs to get out of the car or the door handles are going to be fabric pulls instead. So like I said, everything is going towards that more driver's focused emotional feeling. Um, same thing with the roof there. Um, and what I was getting at when I was talking about the exterior too, is typically on the box there where your roof would go is, is automatic and it kind of just disappears. Um, and where your trunk is, it stays pretty flat. Um, on the Boxster Spider, you can see that you have a very aggressive and kind of well-shaped looking bulge behind your rear seats where that roof folds into. Looks absolutely fantastic, super aggressive, really contributes to how that Boxster Spider looks. Um, so yeah, you do have a very engaging looking car as well. Uh, Few other options I'd like to talk about, um, mostly on the interior here. Um, so as I mentioned, um, it's got the two-toned Bordeaux red interior with the black Spider Classic interior. Um, essentially, the top part of the dash, your doors, um, or I should specify the upper part of your doors, all of those bits are going to be done up in your uh, Bordeaux red leather, along with kind of the perimeter of your seat, so your heads to headrest. I don't know if you can see it in the video, but all those bits are going to be done up in the Bordeaux red leather. Um, your seat centers, armrests, lower bits of the doors, lower part of your dashboard, all of that's going to be done up in black Alcantara. Um, the trim inside the vehicle, so along the dash, doors, and then the trim along your center console where your gear selector is, all of those are going to be done up in painted silver. Um, and then the last noticeable thing I want to talk about in the interior there in terms of cosmetic looks is that it's got the uh, aluminum footrests and pedals. Um, looks absolutely fantastic. A um, few other options to point out on the exterior of the vehicle. You do have your Bose sound system, Apple CarPlay. 
Um, so that's just fantastic from kind of the day-to-day -day usability of the vehicle. And then you're also going to have, of course, your heated steering wheel, heated seats. Um, not too many people do, but uh, if you are wanting to drive the vehicle more into the shoulder seasons, or hey, even year-round, um, the roof is well insulated, so you can do it with proper winter tires, um, then you have the ability to stay warm there as well. Um, this is a pre-owned vehicle, um, so going into a bit of those details on the history of the vehicle, um, this particular example has 10,837 kilometers on it. Um, it is a certified pre-owned vehicle, meaning you will have warranty coverage for six years unlimited kilometers from your first in-service date. Um, and that means essentially first in-service date was August 28th of 2021, meaning you'll have your that warranty coverage until August 28th of 2027, so uh, plenty of coverage there. Um, as far as the kind of condition of your tires and brakes and everything goes, um, I guess really starting with the brakes, you're going to have eight millimeters of front brake pad left, 10 millimeters of life in the rear. For the tires, you're going to have four millimeters of life left up front, and then 4.5 millimeters of life on those rear tires there. Um, talking about the reconditioning and what we had to do to actually be able to certify this vehicle as a CPO car. Um, intermediates was the first one, so that's year two service or at 30,000 kilometers, whichever one comes first. Um, essentially, besides your standard oil and filter change, that's also going to be brake fluid flush, cabin filters, safety inspection around the vehicle. We also did an alignment on the vehicle. Uh, we had to replace the front windshield and then the front lip spoiler. We ended up replacing that because it was a little bit scratched up. Um, so all that stuff's been done. Car's in absolutely fantastic condition. Um, other thing actually I'd actually like to mention on that note too is that the previous owner, owner did put a full body uh, paint protection film on it. Um, so absolutely everything on the car is protected regarding, uh, yeah, regarding the film there. Um, so of course the paint is going to be in excellent condition with that film on it. Um, and great thing about this film as well is that all these newer films are never really yellow. They got warranties protecting you against that. Um, they of course protect the paint. Um, they're hydrophobic and often they have self-healing properties, so great to have that around the entire vehicle. Um, and then as for the history of the vehicle goes, um, this was a local car originally purchased from us, one owner, um, and then clean Carfax, so nothing you have to worry about there, no accidents, damages, anything like that, that's noteworthy. Um, so yeah, overall this vehicle's fantastic package. If you're just looking at something that, like I said, is really just a driver's oriented vehicle, provides you with that visceral drive, but at the same time, you can just go take it out on date night if you want to. Absolutely fantastic. It is available right now as well. Um, Boxer Spider production is very limited and actually it's uh, not, not really giving us any more allocations there. So it presents fantastic opportunity. Um, if you do have any questions regarding the car, don't hesitate to reach out. You can reach out in either the comments of this video or directly to our sales team if you'd prefer. Um, thanks so much for watching everyone. Have a great day.